Hello. Today I have something that I want to share with you that I think every homeschooling family needs. Very important item. And guess what? It only costs two ninety five. And so I want you to rush out today and purchase this item. Well, first I, I guess I better tell you what it is. Okay. It is this very simple jeweler's lupe. And it, it uh, magnifies five times what you would normally see. So the one that I happen to have is called the Private Eye, and I'm not advertising for them at all, but I just love it, so I'm telling you about it. And um, what we use this for in our homeschool is uh, to look at things very closely. And most of the time, uh, that's bugs. <laughs> I do have to tell you, we are a family that is fascinated with bugs. Probably me more than anybody else, besides my son, who should have been an entomologist, but oh well. Anyway, I love this jeweler's lupe. And the way we use it is uh, if we see a bug, then we'll catch it in a jar or something, in a cup, whatever, or just leave it on the wall. And then we'll use this lupe to look at the bug up close and see every detail about that bug more than we probably wanted to see and um, then when you know for first off when you're using this just use it for fun say oh let's look at that close up and your kids once they start using this they will use it for everything and uh, another thing you can look at is leaves you just take that and look really closely and then once they start to look at the leaves they go whoa look at my finger I can't, oh my land look at the lines of that thing and then they'll start looking at the wall and the bark of the tree and just everything. And these things are so, I mean, they weigh nothing. And uh, I keep one in my trailer. I keep one in my purse. I keep one in my car just so that we, whenever something happens, maybe a bug splutters on the windshield and you sort of take your little loop in and look at the stuff. I don't know. But it is fascinating what you can see. And as the kids get older, anyway, as they start to use this more, then you can have them draw or sketch what it is that they're looking at. Because the detail that you see with just this little thing is amazing. So, a jeweler's lupe, it doesn't have to be this one, but I like it because it's cheap and uh, you can give it to your children without worrying out that, oh, they're gonna drop and break it. You can just say, oh, well, I'll take it, whatever. And uh, so that's this. Now, another item that I happen to love and use uh, is a bug container and I say just get any little simple thing I got this I think in the dollar section at Target it was obviously it's very cheap and it comes with this magnifying glass on top and uh, you just catch the bugs and stick them in there and look at them and they can wear, wear this around their neck if they want and it's just quite fascinating you get to look at the bugs and can you tell I love bugs? I really do just love bugs and insects. They're just so fascinating, and there's so many different kinds. And uh, I, my son loved uh, insects and everything about them and bugs, and so I bought him every single book there was I could find about bugs and insects. And uh, as he got older, he developed a... Well, obviously, he knew more about it than me. So we would play this game where we'd try to find a bug and then ask Tyler, hey, do you know what this bug is? And he would get it. He could tell us what the bug was and the characteristics of the bug. I can't believe it. And uh, But he's very knowledgeable. So now that he lives in a different state, we take pictures of the bugs and we send him the pictures. And he can still tell us what those bugs are. It's fascinating. But I think it started from using this simple little jeweler's lupe to check out and see the small little characteristics of, of the bugs and insects or uh, hair or your fingernails. Um, and another plus to this thing is it makes it wonderful for getting out those splinters that kids get in their fingers or in their toes. And uh, you can see very well with this. So rush right out, get one of these. I'll put down in the notes where you can find uh, this for $3.95 if you want to do that. Or you can just go and get your own somewhere you want to go. <laughs> Go to Target, dollar six, and get one of these things. Maybe, you know, it's probably not the season. You can see right here, I have collected something that uh, wound itself in a cocoon, and will be anxiously awaiting the arrival of 
that little goodie. Who knows what it's going to be? So anyway, have fun with that and examine that tiny little world.